In this quick video, I'm going to be showing you how to vertically align the icons on the left hand side of the Divi blur module. Now, by default, the icon will show up towards the top of it, but we want to address that. We want to make the blurb look a little bit more aesthetic. So in this quick video, I'm going to be showing you how to do that. We're going to jump in right now and get started. So we've got two examples here. We've got a blurb with a header and paragraph text, and then we also have a bulleted list. Now, both of these are created using the Divi blurb module. If we go in quickly here and have a look, you can see here we have the title set then also a paragraph text in place also. And if we go into image and icon, you can see here that we're using a Divi icon. Now, this is also applicable to images as long as the image is smaller than the vertical height of the content on the right hand side of the blurb. So let's have a look at how we can vertically align the icon. So the way not to do this would be to go to design image and icon and then maybe look at adding some sort of margin or padding on top of the icon. So if I remove this universal padding here and then look at the top of it and let's maybe add 20 pixels on top. So you can see here our icon moves down. Maybe if we add 30, even 40 or 50, let's go back to 40 actually. Now this looks pretty neat and tidy and looks vertical center to it. However, we want to avoid doing this because based on the screen size, of course, we're going to have to come in and edit this. If the text happens to wrap a certain way, this is no longer going to be vertical center. So we don't want that admin work. We basically just want that icon to remain vertical center, regardless of how the text is responding to screen size on the right hand side of it. Now, how we do this is super simple. All we're going to do is first, we're going to remove that padding that we added. So we're going to come back in here to image and icon remove that, put it back to zero. Then I'm going to come to the advanced tab, custom CSS, and then under where it says blurb image, I'm then going to type in vertical align middle. And then you can see that our icon has fallen down to the vertical center of the text on the right hand side of it. So this code is available to you beneath this video to simply copy paste into your own Divi installation. So we have that single line of code in the blurb image CSS in the advanced tab here. So now you can see when we go to different devices that will stay vertical center, regardless of what the text on the right hand side is doing, which is super awesome. Now let's have a look at a bulleted list. So if we even have a smaller icon where we might be using bullet points, etc. Now, because I have a few of these, I've saved this as a preset. So what I'm going to do is go to module settings. I'm going to come up to my preset, edit the preset itself. The box will turn gray. So we know we're editing the global preset. I'm then going to navigate to the advanced tab, custom CSS, very same thing here underneath blurb image. I'm going to paste my CSS back in vertical align middle. And you can see that these three icons then fall to the vertical center of the text. If I take it away, icons pop back up, put it back in icons, pop back down and align vertical center. So that's how to align the icons on the left hand side of the Divi blurb module. In my opinion, and in a lot of people's opinions, that looks way more aesthetic, but this is the truly responsive way to doing it rather than relying on margin or padding top and bottom to only get the look, but not really have it optimized for all devices. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you found that insightful. If you did like it, don't forget to hit that like button. And of course, if you haven't already subscribe to the Divipreneur channel for more videos like this coming up very, very soon. 